Okay, guys, so here's the thing. I was in California doing some cop watching, and I saw this motorcycle cop get this lady a ticket. Now, what I liked about this cop is that he didn't mind that I was recording. Not that he could do anything legally about it, but for the most, top, for the most part, when officers get upset that you're recording, they'll tell you to step back, get away from me, or you'll get arrested for obstruction. They'll try to get around the First Amendment. They'll do their best to get around the First Amendment. So that's why I respected this officer. I gave him his boundary and his space. And he didn't mind me filming. He didn't do the BS that normal cops do. And I think that's a great thing when dealing with law enforcement. We need more good cops like this. Maybe he's not a good cop. I don't know. But from that interaction, he's like a decent cop. And we need more guys like him. Because more guys like him makes the United States a lot more better. It makes us feel more safer and more comfortable around law enforcement. And that's the whole point. We want to get to the point where we don't need to film the cop, but that's going to be, that's going to take a very long time for that to occur. <laughs> and that's why I do my audits. And that's why I film in public because you have a right to do it and there's nothing wrong with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video as I do my best to add additional commentary and narration throughout the video. Bye bye now. Stand. See, if cops did this, if cops just do their job and let the man record in peace, we'd have no issues. The police wouldn't be going viral on YouTube. But we have cops that don't respect our rights. This cop did a good job in respecting our first rights to film in public. And that's what's important in this video. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Get back to it and enjoy. Yeah. See, I like that professionalism, man. You didn't bother me. You didn't bother me while I was filming. That's what I like to see, man. Professionalism at its finest. Well, you weren't bothering me while I was doing my job either. So. Yeah, that's right. It's like, hey, can I get your uh, business card, though, man? Uh, if I have any. There you are, sir. I appreciate you, man. That's right. what I like, professionalism. Keep it like that, man. Right. You, have a good day. you too. Stay safe, man. Thank you. Yeah. In this next video, this cop is not like the first cop. These officers, well, this male officer 
was very aggressive because I was filming him in his traffic stop and try to blame me for messing with his canine when I wasn't. Get back to the video. Hey, do me a favor. You're, you're making my dog in. And go over there to your job. Go to your job, sir. See, the sign says, please dog, keep away. Don't touch me, sir. I'm not antagonizing. I'm filming you guys. Okay, you can film Stop, stop harassing me. Go back over there. I'm not going anywhere. You can stay back Let's get your advisor. Okay? Otherwise, you're going to walk across. I'm not interfering. You came to me. I have to keep. I don't want to keep on coming over here. Okay? Go over there and do your job. Stay away from my dog. Go do your job. I'm not bothering you, sir. Go do your job. Move your car. How am I antagonizing your dog? I'm not even bothering your dog. That's a lie. See, that's how they do it, brother. So here's the thing, guys. People need to know their rights. And the fact of the matter is, when you're dealing with the cops, you have to stand your ground. Now, if an officer says he's going to arrest you, then you do what you got to do. If you don't want to go to jail, I understand. It's intimidating to be in a place like that. And that's what makes these cops so scary because they can ruin your life and put you in an environment where you don't know what could happen to you. It's unfortunate that these cops are like this. But get back to the video and enjoy. Bye-bye now. Back away. You can film all you want. You gotta stay away from a traffic stop, okay? What law is that? That's the law right here. What's the law? You're, you're making it unsafe for me, and I have to watch you. So you can film hey, back over no. there, please. Thank you. I can film right Thank here. You. you need to back up. What's your name, badge number, sir? Officer Sheeple at King 239. Back up. What about her? What about her? Conducting a traffic stop. You need to stay away. What about her? Stay right there. No, you stay right there. Give me a business card. I need the supervisor now. Damn, I wish I could. I'm gonna give this, I'm gonna say something to you guys. Never consent to a search. Never roll all you want us down and never consent to a search. That's what we do. All right? We don't consent to search. Can I get your name and badge number, ma'am? You got a business card? A business card? All right. Cool. So here's the thing guys, when you're dealing with the cops, you have to know your rights. It's important that you always film the police because it is your first member right to do so. Guys, this incident takes place in California and as you may know, California is pretty corrupt. Get back to the video and enjoy. Make sure they don't plant oh. in the Sure you don't. Oh. There you go. Oh. 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 
we want to make sure that he does nothing to this man's car. You know, these cops are. Always film the police because it is your First Amendment right to do so. Get back to the video and enjoy. Hey, go over there, do your job. Go do your okay, job, so sir. The don't, See, the sign says, please, dog, keep away. Don't touch don't me, sir. My I'm not okay? antagonizing. I'm filming you guys. Okay, you can film stop, me. Stop, stop. Go floor. back over there. I'm not going anywhere. You're going to stay sir, back with your advisor. Okay, okay? okay? otherwise you're going to go interfere across. my investigation. I'm not interfering. You okay? came to me. I have to keep, I don't want to keep on coming over here. Okay? Go over there and do your job. Go do your job. I'm not bothering you, sir. Go do your job. Move your car. How am I antagonizing your dog? Not even bothering your dog. That's a lie. See, that's how they do it, brother. Always film the police. Get back to the video and enjoy. Omaha Cop Watch. Look it up. Omaha Cop Watch. Who knows his rights? Got a headache. Huh? Yeah. Oh. So here's the thing, guys. I'm going to give my final thoughts and commentary for, today, for this particular video. So if you do not want to hear it, leave now because this is the end. So here's the thing. Officers would do their best to stop you from recording. He tried to say I was messing with his dog and I wasn't. All I did was film his vehicle, which is not illegal. And even if I was messing with his dog, let's just say I was... As long as I'm not physically touching the animal or touching the property or the vehicle or anything like that, which is a part of the city property, there's, I'm not doing nothing wrong. I can do jumping jacks. I can stick my tongue out. I can do whatever I want, and it's not illegal. I ain't messing with his dog. But he's lying, and he wants me to stop filming. It's an intimidation tactic to get me away. You know, they don't want you to film the traffic stop. They don't like it because they don't want to be held accountable. But when you do something wrong as a U.S. citizen or any foreigner that comes to the United States, they put you in jail so you can be held accountable. Accountability for, accountability for us, but not for them. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Check out the community tab at 3 p.m. Central Time. I'm out, guys. Peace.